here in the Livestock Pavilion happening right now is the Governor's Annual Charity Steer Show. First steer into the ring is sponsored by the Iowa Beef Industry Council and the Iowa Cattlemen's Association. And you will recognize Governor Kim Reynolds leading our steer in. Welcome to the 41st edition of the Governor's Charity Steer Show. The 24 competitors are lined up and the celebrity interviews are underway. Well, first of all, it's an incredible um, opportunity to showcase, you know, the cattle industry and all that our cattle producers do all across the state, the importance, the role that they play in feeding not only Iowa, but the country and the world. You know, I'm used to being around world-class competitors, world record holders, world champions. This guy right here is the first time I've ever seen an athlete gain 20 or 80 pounds between competitions. It is such a great cause and awesome to be here. And um, I would say he's getting a little deja vu from being in, a, in another show, because he's done a few shows, he's a pro. But you know what, I would not want to spend my last few hours as the Iowa State Fair Queen other than showing cattle. I'm subbing in for Ryder, he's in the middle with my wife Haley. Uh, a little over a year ago, he was born eight weeks early, uh, two pounds, 14 ounces. Uh, we got life flighted down here to Des Moines, and in the middle of the night, we talked about just wondering what we're going to do. We're going to have to drive back and forth, everything like that. And we've, that's when we first found out about the Ronald McDonald House. Uh, just a great, great organization, and they do so much good for so many people. During the competition, Will Vlasic from Cedar Rapids and Colby Fevold of Gladbrook received the Community Hero Award. This year's steer judge is Brad Pellet from Iowa. It looks like Pellet has selected his top five, but before we see who is chosen as this year's champion, let's see who is awarded the Grand Champion Showman and the People's Choice Awards. Great job, or I should say three teams of showmen that really did a great job, but uh, I have to select one and I'm going to do that now. It's Iowa Secretary of Agriculture Mike Nag and Junior owned by Emma Wason. Okay. Next is the Battle for the People's Choice Award. The crowd is certainly making this one difficult. Marianne Fox and Taylor Quaid. It's team number 12 with the 2022 Iowa State Fair Queen, Marianne Fox, and her youth partner, Taylor Quaid from Charles City. Now Brad Pellet is bringing back his top five. Let's get a few words from the judge. You know, the greatest state fair in the country has one of the greatest events that we can showcase the beef industry and the charity and the collaboration between the you know two great organizations. I want to congratulate these exhibitors. They have made my job here extremely difficult. With that being said, again, thank you so much for this opportunity. I'll go out and pick your champion steer. It's Blake Bolden with Drake University and his partner Tyson Moore from Ladora with the steer Batman. How does it feel to have the winner today at the Governor's Charity Steer Show? Feels like a lot of my hard work's really starting to pay off. Feels really good. Well, we never doubted we'd win. I mean, it's a lot of fun. Uh, Tyson's done an incredible job with this young steer, and uh, it's been a lot of fun to be part of it. Really exciting and a humbling experience. Yeah! Now it's into the auction ring. This year, the steers sold at auction brought in more than a half a million dollars, yes! pushing the total raised for Ronald McDonald House Charities of Iowa to nearly $5.5 million. And that's how we finished up.